Exercise 3B, designing a crest vertical curve. Design a length of vertical curve for a crest curve based on sopping site distance and the following information. We have a design speed of 40 miles per hour, a grade one of 1.25%, and a grade two of a negative 2.75%. First, determine the A, which is the change in grade. If we look at the equation, A equals G2 minus G1, or the absolute value of G2 minus G1. If we plug in the numbers, we get the following value of A equal 4%. Next, we're going to determine the stopping site distance. We're going to utilize Table 3-2 in the AASHTO 2018 Green Book. We're going to assume a downgrade slope of 2.75%. If we utilize the chart, the closest percent is the 3% value. When we look at the design speed and the 3% downgrade, we get a stopping site distance of 315 feet and we'll use that for our site distance. Next, we're going to determine the length of curve. We're going to assume that S is greater than L. In doing so, we're going to use the following equation of L equals 2S minus 2,158 divided by A. When we plug in the numbers, we get the following, and we get a length of curve of 90.5 feet. The assumption is correct of S less than L. We have found the minimum length of curve, but remember MoDOT recommends a length, a minimum length of curve at least 300 feet when possible. What if we had started with the assumption of S less than L? We would use the following equation. We would plug in the numbers and get a value of L equal 183.92 feet. Unfortunately, that assumption of S less than L is wrong. We would have to use the first equation that we used of S greater than L to obtain the correct answer.